Um, so I did ask you one of the questions I asked you, which, which I thought was probably one of the most interesting seg segments I've ever heard on the radio show was where the, uh, the girl, I, I forgot the, the name of the segment, but where the girl called in and was talking about, uh, some guy. Date she was what is it? Yeah. Okay. Date dilemma. Say that one more time. It used to be the date dilemma. It used to be the second date, date update, but it's called the date dilemma now. Yeah. Okay. Got it. What what was the end result of that? Because I actually I investigated it and I could not get any answers. But after she said that, do you, do you know what happened? Well, basically, she said, let me explain. She said that a guy that she was dating had killed her brother. And she overheard. Yeah, she didn't know. Mm -hmm. yeah, she was with him and some friends and overheard him having a conversation. And I guess they've been drinking and, you know, people get a little loose when they're drinking. And uh, as he was talking about it. The guys kind of said some things, some key things that made her be like, wait, that's my brother you're talking about. So it got interesting because detectives came to my my radio station. Oh, wow. Called us. Mm -hmm. I even had people telling me they know about it. Like, they know what's going on. They know who did it. And they know when it happened. I'm just like, look, man, I don't want no parts of this because it's not what we did it for. We're not unsolved mysteries. We're not a cold case file show. <laughs> you know, it, it wasn't any of that. But yeah. it, it played out like that. Just shows you how, how 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 life works, man. You know what I'm saying? Your your attempt, your aim is for one thing, mm -hmm. but if the wind blows enough, it will change the trajectory of whatever your efforts are, and you'll land somewhere else. And that's how we got to that space. So we don't really know what happened, ever happened after that. We mm -hmm. tried to contact the girl; her number changed. So I mean, that was it. But she was probably bombarded too. Was that the wildest? Oh, sure was that the wildest segment that you had, or did anything else has anything? The wildest else? thing, nah, it, it it's, it's happened plenty of times. We had this one, uh, this this white guy called because his girl, he was this this new this black woman he was dating, never really dated a black woman. He just was so offended, not offended, but he was like, he was over her because, um, I guess when he met her, she was one way, and then she he felt like she tried to become too Hollywood. Because mm -hmm. she started wearing all these wigs and, you know, she shaved her eyebrows off just to draw them back on. And, mm -hmm. you know, he felt like she was trying to get too slim to look like a model or something that, I don't know. But um, on our show, she revealed to him that she was dealing with a stage four cancer. Oh, wow. And that she had not, yeah, she had not revealed to him. So it's kind of that stuff. She was just like, it was so early on. She didn't want to put him that deep in her business, but he had actually started to fall for her. And he was just like, yo, she changed. She went all this makeup and drawing on her eyebrows. Now. Oh, man. She That's... used to wear her natural hair. Wow. But he didn't know there was weed. That He just thought she was wearing weed. So when she broke down and told him, no, actually, let me just tell you, I'm, I'm dealing with the, you know, with, with the stage four cancer. And, you know, I didn't want to drag you down, but I didn't know that, you know, the change in, my appearance was that drastic. Because in her mind, she still looked the same. But yeah, it was it was pretty tough because we was in the studio, everybody was crying, you know, trying to figure out like, wow, like sometimes you don't even you don't even know the type of you don't know the type of play yeah. that life will give you. You, know you don't what know I mean? what people are going through. Yeah. Yeah. You don't. Know?